The controversial Dutch politician Gert Wilders is about to make his first speech in Australia at a venue in Melbourne. His anti-Islam views are sparking protests and SBS Gareth Borum is there. Uh, Gareth, things are getting heated. Yes, Ricardo, Gert Wilders is due to speak here at a public meeting on Melbourne's outskirts at a uh, supposedly secret location where a uh, picket line set up by protesters has just turned ugly. Uh, demonstrators uh, have clashed with guests as they try to make their way uh, through the picket line and into the venue. Uh, and uh, police and horses have been called in uh, to break up the blockade, which uh, police say is illegal. And uh, we believe that at least one arrest has already been made. Now, the uh, various uh, fracas continue to, to break out here and, uh, and tensions, as you can imagine, uh, are remaining uh, pretty high. Now, earlier in the day, um, also at a supposedly secret location, Gert Wilders uh, held a press conference where he showed, I guess, just, just why he has become such a lightning rod for uh, such angry protests with his uh, anti-Islam stance. Uh, now, here's just a taste of what he had to say earlier in the day. We have to be able to talk in a free society about the character of Mohammed. Mohammed was a warlord, a terrorist, a pedophile. And I would not say that if not today, one and a half billion people believe that Mohammed is the best example to follow. I'm not saying, of course, that it would be ridiculous to get on the weg. Now the, now, the next stop on the uh, Builders Australian tour is uh, Perth, where uh, there are unconfirmed reports that uh, venues have already uh, pulled out of, uh, of hosting the uh, controversial Dutch politician. Uh, and uh, his, his uh, next stop after that will be in Sydney later in the week, uh, where I think we can also expect uh, more high security and more protests. Back okay. to you, Ricardo. Gareth Gorham, they're reporting from Melbourne.